Well, welcome back, folks. We're right here at Heber City, Utah at the Western Regional Finals. we got the Junior Looper going on right here, and we just finished up the number 11 shootout. And what a roping that was right here. Let's break it down and see what happens. We're going to start with the 12th callback, and it's a team out of Kingman, Arizona. Husband and wife duel with Peg Williams and Jim Williams. Now, they're a 3598, and they need to be a 1272 to jump to the lead. And they rope this year good. Clean run right here of 877 brings their total to 44 and 75, and they're now number one. We'll go to the eighth high team back. Here is Scott Sandberg, and his partner is Brad Alexander. They come to us from Washington, Utah. They are 3384. A run of 1090 would take them to the lead. Scott gets out on the steer and gets him caught and moves him out. Brad comes around. They're clean right here with an 838, putting them at 42 and 22, and they jump to the top. We're going out of the fifth high team back. It's Heavy Sursa and Chad Craig. Blue Bell, Utah, and Payson, Utah. They're 30 and 74. These guys, 1147 to go to the number one position. Heavy gets him caught right here. Chad comes around. They're clean. 974. They're now number one as they're 40 and 48. It's the fourth high team back. It's DA Pole. His partner is Rick Steed. These guys, Utah and Idaho combination. They've been friends for a long time, roping good here today. They're 2675. They need to be a 1372 to go to the lead. DA on a great horse gets him caught. Rick comes around. They're 941, putting him at 36 and 16. That is now number one. The third high team back is Jared Udy and Clay Broadhead. This team is a 26 and 66. They need to be a 949 to go to the lead. And they are going to catch him right here. But a 1361 with a leg. They're 40 and 27. Puts them second. The high team back is Willie Reed and Chad Craig. They're 24 46 and they have problems. No time. And so the win of the roping, it's D.A. Pole and Rick Steed. These guys are going to win $10,000. Brand new Martin Trophy saddles. DA Pole and Rick Steed, these guys coming from the fourth high team back. Let's talk to our champions right here of the number 11 shootout. We just finished up with our uh, number 11 shootout and the champions, DA Pole and Rick Steed. I'm standing here with the champion header, DA. What a roping for you today. You qualified fourth back. What was your game plan in the short round? Just rope a steer around the horns and go left. <laughs> How did you get partnered up with Rick Steed? Well, we've been friends for years, years. We've roped together for a long time. And uh, so uh, you guys were fourth high team back, jumped in the lead. Were you nervous at all about any of this or just, just roping another steer? Well, I tried to just make it just one more steer, but sometimes the callbacks makes it a little more pressure than just one more steer. <laughs> Absolutely. So it paid it paid 10000 bucks right here. Tell me about the payout here at the Western Regional Finals. Well, the... USTRC is the greatest association that I've ever been affiliated with, and uh, I really like the $5,000 a man payoff. That's great. Hey, that's wonderful, DA. Well, congratulations on this big win and this saddle right here, and uh, good luck the rest of the weekend. Well, here's our champion healer out of the number 11 shootout, Rick Steed. Rick, you guys were fourth high team back. What, what were you thinking as you backed in the box? Well, I roped with DA all my life and I knew I didn't have to worry about him and I just wanted to make sure I'd cleaned up what was there. And then you guys made a great run right there and then you had some what about three more teams to sweat. Were you nervous at all or what was done was done? Well I was down at the other end spitting and I about run out of spit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah well hey it worked out and then you guys uh, take home 10,000 bucks in these brand new saddles. How does that make you feel? Good it was a good roping. You guys have put on a good roping. And uh, so tell me, tell me about the facility here and moving, moving this over to, the, to uh, Heber City. Oh, it's the people here just bend over backwards to help team ropers. And the facility, you can't get no better. It's good. Absolutely. Well, Rick, congratulations. Great roping today. And uh, good luck the rest of the weekend. All right. Thank you.